Hello, this is Last Garden Standing, and I am just going to bring you a short video to show you my indoor greenhouse and some of the herbs and veggies that I've got going to plant outside before too long. You can eat those herbs right now, and you can plant very soon outside. The only reason I haven't planted already is because it's raining, but my this is my top shelf. Now this is spinach that I've had in the little indoor greenhouse under lighting. It is ready to go outside as soon as it stops raining. I've got a couple tomatoes back there, which is getting big, so I want them to go out pretty soon too. Here's a pineapple sage. Wonderful taste in sage. It's not like your normal sage. It is not a perennial, so you have to bring it in in the winter. But it's a beautiful house plant. It has a big old pink flowers. So it's called a pineapple sage, though. So I've got the spinach and the sage and the tomatoes up here, and they're awaiting to go out, which I will do very soon. Down here is my herbs. I hope you can see it with the lighting. There's some chives, boy, and I have already been eating off these herbs for a month. So you, they do just fine in your house, your little greenhouse with lighting especially. Uh, depends how much light you get in your house too, but I have the artificial lighting. Here's the sweet basil. Been using it in tons of things, chicken salad, Salads galore, chives too. So let's move that, see if we can't see a little bit better some of the others. Right here I've got dill. Dill has been growing, it looks a little choppy now because I have been eating off that dill for a month, like I said. And it too goes in good in tuna, on eggs, it's just real good in salads, so forth. Back here is a bunch of cilantro. Let me see if I can get it up here. Beautiful cilantro. I've already cut it and it's grown back two or three times. It's just chuck full. And cilantro's good in Mexican food, on tacos. It's also good in salad, depends how if you like the taste. Uh, I love the cilantro in tuna, on fish, everything. So we've got those, the, there's my chives, two of them, cilantro. There's the dill back there. Here is some more basil, so I'm just eating that left and right. Here's some rosemary. Rosemary is real good on eggs, in, on fish, tuna. It's a little harsh uh, in salads, but it's real good. Um, if you put it in chicken salads, in a mixture, or turkey salad, or so forth. So here is my little herbal garden here in the house. We do have other things in here. As you can see, there's some cactuses grown and some succulents. But the herbs are doing just beautiful. And I'm keeping those vegetables nice for going outside real soon. So eat your herbs now and plant soon, whether it's March or not. I am in uh, northern Utah, so the weather can change. It is weird. It goes from cold to hot, but the spinach doesn't mind the cold weather. The tomatoes I may cover, which I have made a, a little cover for them. And they'll do fine under cover. The pineapple sage better stay in the side yet, though, for a little while. Don't plant that outside yet. So here's my little herbal garden, and this is last garden standing. Please share, like, comment, and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed this just little clip. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.